you know that you're worth it to God? Do you know that He values you more than anything? Do you know that He sent His one and only Son in order for you to be able to have a relationship with Him? No, I'm not a father, but I have to think that, that would be the most difficult thing that you'd ever have to do. Listen here. Jesus, who was perfect, sent to this earth to be ridiculed, to be spit on, to be beaten, and to die on a cross, a sinner's death. The one and only person to ever be perfect, nailed to a cross for our sins. Do you believe that you're worth it? Now, I'm a sinful man who doesn't have things together. And this concept is really hard for me to understand and believe in. Now, it's hard for me to think and comprehend that the God of the universe loves me that much. I have a dirty side, full of sin, lust, and all this stuff called sin. Yet, He loves me. In Romans 5, 8, it says, While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Can you believe that? While we're still sinners and denying Christ, He still loves us. A verse that everyone knows, John 3.16, For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have eternal life. Think about it. Think about how much God loves you. Knowing the sin and struggles in my life, I find it really hard that the Creator of the universe loves me. Undeservingly, He still loves me. Now in 1 Peter 3.18, it says, For Christ died for our sins, once and for all, the righteous and the unrighteous, me, to bring you to God. Christ died for everything that I've done, everything that is going on in my life, everything that you've done and what's going on in your life. Now if we don't accept this gift, we are doomed to a place of eternal damnation. Take courage. But here's the good news. John 3.18 says, For whoever believes in Him is not condemned. What do you have to lose? A life full of hope and promise? Or a life that is doomed to hell? Should or is there even a different answer? A different solution to this question of the eternal afterlife? This is the life that I want. I want life. I want eternal life. I want to live my life to the fullest. And I know that only through Christ Jesus that can be accomplished. I want you to know that the God of the universe, the Creator, the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and end, He loves and cares about you. He thinks you're worth it. Now why else would He sacrifice everything one and only son who is perfect in order to have a relationship with him. That's a love of God. Now think about this. Now this is a serious decision. But don't you want eternal security? I want you guys to know and I want you to understand that God loves you. And he really thinks that you're worth it. Are you ready to take that leap of faith? Waste another day. We never know when our time is over with here on earth. Don't waste another day. Accept the endless and great love of a Savior. Don't waste another day. It's your decision.